Whether you're interested in working with us or you just wanna know how we do it. In this video, I'm gonna be walking you through how we create Instagram content for our clients on a monthly basis. Hello friends and welcome back to our channel. My name is Shelby here at Creatorly Media and I'm excited to dive in and talk you through how we create Instagram content for our clients. Now let's start by talking about the onboarding process for new clients. Once a potential client purchases one of our packages, we put them through our onboarding process. Most importantly, we like to welcome them to the Creatorly team and tell them a little bit more details about the process and how it's gonna work, which is is exactly what I'm sharing with you in today's video. In this welcome email, we also give them a list of what we need for them depending on the service or package they purchase. This might include their Instagram access, their later access if they have one, and all of their branding assets. So once we've gone through the onboarding process and we assign them to an Instagram manager, then it's time to set up their first strategy meeting. Prior to the strategy meeting, the Instagram manager will do some extensive research and prepare an agenda for the meeting. This agenda will normally include suggestions of content we should continue doing, new content we might want to experiment with, prompts and questions for the client, and even maybe a list of things we need from the client that month. This is also an opportunity for the client to tell us anything that they really wanna talk about on their Instagram that next month. That might be a specific topic that is timely or maybe a launch that they're doing with one of their products or services. Whatever the client really wants to talk about, we will of course fit that into their strategy. We leave the meeting just having a better understanding about their overall brand, their goals, and anything they really wanna talk about in this upcoming month. I guess that brings me to also explain how our process works as far as batching content. So for example, if we meet a client the 1st of April, we are actually talking about content for May. So all the work that we do in April is to create a month worth of content for the next month, which in this case would be May. Moving on to the second step in our process, this is when we build our strategic content calendar for the client. This calendar will include 20 post ideas, all of which are gathered from our research and of course our strategy meeting with the client. With each concept, we will let the client know exactly what type of post it is, when it would be published, also if we need anything from the client to make it happen. Once we have the client's approval on all of the post concepts, that's when we begin our content creation process. We have a process internally of creating content in two different stages, and between each stages, the manager of the account will give feedback to the team and make any internal revisions needed before delivering it to the client. Depending on the needs of the client, we create various different post types, reels, carousel graphics, infographics, feed videos, captions, and more. Once we've created all of the content and all 20 posts are complete, we will send the finalized content calendar to the client for review and approval. If they have any revisions or changes to the content we created, we will make it at this time. Finally, once all of the content is complete and and approved by the client, that is when we schedule it for them in our scheduling platform of choice, which is later. Not only that, as a little added bonus, we actually handle posting for the client as well. So once everything is scheduled and later, we have a team member with a work phone who actually posts everything for our clients. Some posts might be auto-published and others are posted manually, and we have an actual real-life person who is doing that for our clients. Shout out to Katsuki. Sune, you're the best. If this sounds like a good fit for you, we would love to talk to you more. If you prefer just getting value from these videos, then make sure that you're subscribed so you don't miss the next one. Thank you so much for watching and keep on creating.